three of the trims that we used on a drawer itself. So it's 124, which is that beautiful wavy design, 714, which is a new design, and 720, our belt and pearls. And on the side of the chest of drawers, we're gonna apply 1301 with a molding, but not as it is. We're gonna modify it, so we're gonna cut it, sand it, and make something uh, different from as it is. And today we give away a beautiful sand, so Morocco Melody. Moroccan, or yeah, Moroccan, Moroccan Melody. melody. <laughs> so, uh, to win it, all you need is like, put a like, share it any way you think that uh, people might like to see our products. And give a lot of hearts, love, it's Friday, come on! I want to see you more active. Ecco, quindi come promesso, oggi, uh, visto che le scorse settimane, quattro settimane di, di fila abbiamo fatto le cassette, i cassetti di, di un cassettiere, oggi ci andremo con il cassettiere, quindi uh, apriremo i freggi e i cordoni, tre dei cordoni che abbiamo utilizzato su, sui cassetti e 1301, la terza generazione, sui lati che lo taglieremo, lo modificheremo per avere il nostro proprio design diverso. Però oggi come ci diamo via il stencil Marocca Melody per semplicemente mettere mi piace e condividere il nostro live. Una volta che avete fatto questo, fateci sapere nella comment section dei commenti sotto, così che sapremo anche noi. Uh, okay. Grazie per il lavoro, buono. Lo spazio per... Ok, perfetto. Uh, so, without uh, further ado, don't forget to give away the Moroccan uh, Melody stencil, like, share and sprinkle, and I'm going to start the project. I'm going to put a 13 out of 3 with beautiful design on the side and we're gonna go with the top stopper and seeing that I already have some of the wood band on the griddle so one two three four yep they are really nice bendy and flexible wood band for those of you who haven't seen them before is a very very crafty and useful material as you might apply it on any project that you might need and on any surface as long as you have good quality wood glue as it con contains a high percentage of wood in it it's basically wood, it has all the properties of wood you can uh, sand it, you can drill it and when you sand or drill you have an actual sawdust from, uh, from it and Painted, pre painted, basically everything that you would be able to do with natural wood, you are able to do with the uh, wooden products. With one extra, as you, can, as you saw, once it's warmed up, it's really flexible and bending and gives you a lot of opportunities where to apply it. There's almost no surface where you ain't gonna be able to do it. Like any shape, as long as it's warmed up really good with a heat gun, hair dryer or electric grill, it's all up to you, it has an infinite possibilities. And we've got, hi Boston, bonjour France, hi Pennsylvania, we've got loads of people watching today, hi everybody. Yeah. Right, so to apply it, so you have exactly the same quality that we do here, all I have to do is to follow five easy steps. So you have to warm it up properly you have to apply the glue on the back so that the back of the molding, the footprint will be completely covered in glue and as you can, can see you may apply the glue on the back of the molding or the trim or on the surface itself it's important that the footprint, the back of the molding should be completely covered with glue and attached when it's attached to the surface to clean the extra glue if needed <laughs> you may, you might wait. That's the only one thing. With a wet wipe, with a cotton board, or with a wet paintbrush. It's all up to you and your preference. Uh, for the trees, for example, I find it much, much easier to go with a wet wipe. As 
it's much faster. Oh, with a wet wipe, uh, with a wet paint brush. It's all up to you. Okay. We've got some love being sprinkled. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Friday people. So uh, now, once you have done the service, you have to do the fall and the fifth step. So basically, you have to reactivate, to warm it up again, and press it down once more. We're doing that to make sure that in between the surface and the back of the molding, there is no area that are not attached or just that are quick in air bubbles. So here it is, and as you see, it's very easy to apply it. Uh, okay. I know. Once that's done, we go on to the second one. Good morning, Beth from Rekindle. Um, it's lovely to see you here. Um, Beth is a big ambassador of ours and we absolutely love her work. So we just I thought we'd that. say a hi before me. Hi, keeps on pressing down with some glue. <laughs> okay, ready? Another line of glue. So. And don't forget for everybody who's just joined, we're giving away this beautiful stencil. It's the Moroccan Melody. Yep. Yeah, Moroccan Melody. Uh, it's absolutely gorgeous, really good quality. And all you have to do to win is like, comment, and share the video. And we'll be announcing the winner on a Monday on the uh, Artisans group, which I'll post a link to that in the comments. Right now that we have the glue on, again, we're going to press it down. Oh, bonjour, CB. Give me yeah. a wiggle. Wait, 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 wait. Was it you don't say wiggle, wiggle? Wormy, wormy. Wormy, wormy, squirmy. And, wait, wait. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> and I'm gonna press it down. And of course, if I want a clean, nice surface, I'm gonna clean the extra glue. If you go for a texture surface, don't even bother about it. Okay. Alright, oh, too. I quite like that. So, what's our plans for the weekend? Yeah, yeah what is everybody's plans for the weekend? Bonjour, Michel. As well. So, I like when people say hi to each other. You, um, feel, you feel kind of like a cute community? Yeah, it's lovely. I love the Friday life. Everybody's just in such a weekend mood. Everyone wants to party, have fun. Speaking of parties, I don't know if everybody's seen, but on Monday, we have got a party going on with Jonathan Martin Mendez from the House of Mendez. And he is coming to celebrate our new product releases. Wow, well, if that was supposed to be a um, surprise party. <laughs> it's already you just, live. You just <laughs> <made it. laughs> Down really well. When you're in the pit step, you might see some of the glue popping up from under the surface and the uh, woven product, which is a good sign, which means that the back of it is properly attached and rejects any extra uh, glue that you might find on the, in between. Okay. As well, I'm putting in the comments where you can find a stockist in your area because we've got a few people asking where can we buy these products. Uh, I wish you sold them in some some places. So I'm going to share this and you can find a stockist near you. So, guess what I'm going to do now? I'm going to mitre the teams so they will fit or match the side. Could you spin that one more now. time? You know, like in those uh, TV shops. Yeah. Give me another spin. Only today, only for you, like twenty two ninety nine. Yeah, and it was twenty three oh one. That's quite good. So now I'm gonna take. And they have bought that you will have it with our 1301 molding. So then I'm gonna cut the okay the trim so it will fit 
So at the minute we've got 128 views on this video. If we can get it to 200, Solly's going to give away another bag of broken mouldings alongside the stencil. So that will be two winners to be announced on the and Monday. And I'm just reminding that soon, shortly, we're going to sell those bags. So if you want it for free, don't lose time. <laughs> so share, 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 go share in and when we get 200, we'll show you the bag of broken mouldings available to win. Well, now we definitely sound like a TV show. <laughs> yeah, now we do. <laughs> share, 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 so you can win that. And that's how we have it. Nice and clean. So now all we have to do is like to... There it is. Have some sandpaper. And sand and smooth down the areas. Ravenna, we've got Ravenna watching in Italy. <laughs> yeah. I always wanted to go to Ravenna, it's so beautiful. I can't disagree with that. Yeah, where did you live when you lived in Italy? Well, uh, Brescia, mostly north. Yeah. Brescia and then uh, Verona. I was planning on travelling and then the pandemic hit and I had to come home and I literally had my tickets booked to Emilia Romagna. I was like, I'm off, I'm off to Bologna. <laughs> yeah, here we have it. Nice and smooth edge. Okay, now we're gonna go for the third one. And the third one is gonna be 714, which we're gonna bend it along the top. And as you can see, the shape is not the easiest one. But there's nothing impossible for our super. We've got Bulgaria watching. Um, Delania shared it two days ago. Yeah, she did. Two time with this, but that's the thing, there's no limit to the amount of times you share it. If anything, you've got more of a chance of winning. So keep sharing. Because it's free. Because it is free, and you'll get more free stuff. <laughs> really? Yep. Okay. Okay. So, all I need, as I said, is a good quality wood glue. We're using at the moment to uh, type on quick, uh, quick and thick, but it doesn't matter that you can't use the other, unless it's PVA. Mm, don't use PVA because we've tried it and it's not the best for wood event. Okay, so now that the surface is covered, yeah, I'm a hands on person, so I like to spread the glue with. My hands. Oh, no, maybe like that. And then once it's warm, oh, while it's warm, I'm gonna bend it over. What's your favorite part of doing the demonstrations? Is it the glue? <laughs> the glue and the stencil reveal. When you use it, when we use the stencil, it's. But you know, with the stencil reveal, I have few accidents, and every time, it's like kind of like, <laughs> will it be okay, or will it be like? Not okay. <laughs> uh, right. so. Hello, South Florida, Houston, Texas, Portugal. Ooh, Portugal. Oh, Nettie says I've sent love and shared, and I'm going to try out my nearest stockist today. Uh, and then she's going to have dinner at a very nice place. <laughs> and then for the weekend, she's going to be practicing chalk painting and using wood you bend, of course. That's what we like to see. That's exactly what we do on a weekend as well, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so now I'm just going to mount it. Ready? Yep. Okay, and look at that. Oh, wow, that's perfect. So there is no shade that it's impossible for wood to bend as long as it's warm up or warm and it's in its elastic state. And it's fighting mold. <laughs> so who is that? 
Well, we've got Rekindle Blessing, that's Beth, that's our wonderful ambassador. Laura says it's a fabulous trim, it is, it's absolutely beautiful this trim. I honestly think the trims are one of my favourite things because the applique's are gorgeous but the trims just add like such an element of elegance to anything you put it on. That's, that's the thing because uh, maybe with some of the mouldings you, you can't use them and apply them on any project or anywhere. But with a trim, even if it's a thin one, yeah, it will just... It just give, adds to it. Yeah. I mean, because it like separates stuff, it just, just adds some gives a bit of character to yeah. the project. Even though if you don't want a lot, just some border or a line. Keep in mind is that uh, wood burn would take exactly the same amount of time of now with a third generation that has a higher density, it will take longer to cool down than it took to get one down. So, give, that gives you a lot more time and possibility to bend it, to work it, to shape it your way. Oh, that's for you from Diane MK. Espero lia ya se encuimente. Hola, Diana, como estas? Okay, so now the extra glue that I have here, I'm going to take it off with the wet thin brush. You know what we forgot to do? Mm -hmm. To press the time. Oh yeah, it's fine, I'll keep my on it. <laughs> or if not, everybody's going to get lucky and see me how doing this until Sunday. <laughs> nope. I got that for this weekend. What are you doing this weekend? Well, hopefully, hopefully I'm going to the safari park. Oh, wow. Okay, that's fun. So, seeing that we have nice weather, finally, during the weekend, not during the, the week, because usually what, what's happening is that during the week it's a nice, beautiful weather. During the weekend, rainy, cloudy, windy, whatever you want, just not the weather that you would like. Could you please yes. really quickly sand that bottom bit just so I can get another shot on the camera? Yes. Thank you. Ready? Yeah. Okay. Thanks. You're welcome. Well, now I have to be on the other side as well. Oh, Diana's so sweet. <laughs> okay, yeah. so that's what's in here. Now we're going to go for the painting part. So to paint the, uh, the top, we're going to do it with Sweet Milk by the, uh, the Magic and Fleur de Sel by the Magic. Before using uh, any paint, just make sure that you mix it, you shake it, so you will activate all of its components. I'm not doing it now because I'll be already before the live. And you can, for the molding, we would recommend you to use a pointed paint brush as it helps a lot to go into all the nooks and crannies of the designs. I see that the magic is very quality paint. It covers like from the first layer. You might not even need a second one. I think this set of drawers for everybody who's been watching the series, we've been doing a draw every Friday and it's my favourite thing that we've done since I started because I've been here for about five weeks now and every time we get the drawers out, I'm like, oh yeah! <laughs> so I'm really excited to start finishing it. So um, that will be season one. <laughs> yes, season one of the draw. I'm saying this like I'm the one finishing it. I'm just going to try watching me I do it. <laughs> And I'll just remind that we give away today yes. a stencil, Moroccan Melody, for like, share and sprinkle. 
So remember, a like, share and a comment and some sprinkled love as well would be wonderful. And we'll be announcing the winner of this fantastic stencil on Monday. And as well, if we can get this video to 200 likes, we're also giving away another bag of free Would You Bend mouldings. So these are mouldings that we've used in the studio that perhaps we've cut off, so from trims and, you know. So that's a surprise great. bag. It's a little surprise guinea bag. But you've seen that we've done quite a few projects with uh, broken mouldings. So even if they are broken, that doesn't mean that you can't create anything with them. You know what? I think that we ain't gonna need a second layer. Oh wow. <laughs> so everybody comment what you're doing at the weekend. I know a couple of people are gonna be practicing their woody bending skills. It's like Avatar, isn't it? Avatar the water bender or whatever it is. <laughs> Would you bend? What else is everybody doing? Anybody going on some trips? Seeing family? Going out for a meal? I could go out for a meal. Voila. <laughs> That's gorgeous. The paint just really brought it out. Giovanna says, oh, beautiful it is. It's gorgeous. <laughs> okay, so while that part is drying, as we finish with this, we're going to go to the big boss, which is our just or jobbers without jobbers. We ain't going to do until it's finished. Okay, right. so I'm going to move the camera back, yes. everyone, so it might wiggle for a bit. I am sorry. <laughs> go as quick as I can. Um. Look at our wonderful floor. <laughs> So much love and likes and sprinkles coming in. Uh, I almost want to sing. Love, love, love. So, no, I'll stop singing. Uh, are you staying here or do you want to twist no, the No, I'll, I'll stay here. Just, I guess we can do it even lower. So we will face it exactly there. Alright. You see, look at this dynamic camera work. <laughs> Uh, Solange is asking, are those the new trims? Uh, two of them, yes. 720 and 714. So you're those seeing this exclusive. <laughs> well, on Monday we're going to release more of them, so stay tuned as we're going to show you something more. Right, so as I said, uh, 1301, we're going to apply them on the side but see that we have quite a few of them broken we're gonna cut so we're gonna match one and two so they're gonna mirror one another you see here so i'm gonna take the board so i just put it on the griddle and look how flexible it is okay and Yeah. Uh, okay, so to make sure that it is going to be much easier to cut it, I don't think you can see it here. I'm going to roll it up. Okay, so now we're going This one, uh, it's wiggly and flexible, so now I'm going to cut it along the line. And all we need is a craft knife. And if you have some of the edges like that, don't, even, don't worry about it, as with the sandpaper, you can do miracles! 
Yeah, so Solange is saying this molding is fantastic because you can put decoupage on the center of it. It's yes. beautiful. You can put a decoupage or even another molding that we have that are sold like a S5. So we have lion heads, we have flowers, and all kind of small things, right? So that's one. So I'm doing exactly the same for the second one. As I said, I don't know, but it's, that's not great. So, so I have one there. Y sí, Tiara, estoy de acuerdo completamente, son fantásticas y el lunes verás las nuevas motores que tenemos. Um, entonces, sí. <laughs> Get ready. ¿Ve? Okay. Look how easy it is. Now it's just one drop. Yeah, it's great to say it's one piece, you can turn it into like three, four, even five pieces, depending on what you're after. So as you can see, that part, that edge, and that smooth one. For example, if you want, you can take the leftovers and to add them here and to create another design. So we have to warm them up and apply them on the surface with a good quality wood bloom. As you can see, yeah, it's visible. Yeah, I already marked the center, so I'm not gonna go sideways. Don't forget everybody watching, you can still win the wonderful stencil. I'll go get it because we've left it on the bench. <laughs> Here we go. If I don't drop it on me, hi. We've got the Moroccan Melody stencil available to win. So all you have to do is like, share, comment that you've liked it and maybe sprinkle some love as well. And we'll be announcing the winner on Monday in the Art Design and Creators group. Oh, hello, Greece. We've got Greece watching. Hello. Was it Yassas? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Could be. I'm pretty sure that there are more than one word for hi. Yeah. <laughs> 
Ya. Diana says, the stencil is incredible, I need it in my life. Yo también, de verdad. It's going to look beautiful when it's done. Solange says hi to Solly Joe. It's about 33 degrees where she is. Ooh, I wonder how hot it is today. It's actually quite warm in the UK today. I've got my shorts on. <laughs> That's when you know it's hot. So now for, uh, for that case, for example, you might use a cotton ball to go into all the nooks and crannies and to clean it properly. But to be honest, it's much easier with a wet paintbrush. So that's what I'm gonna do. Seeing that I want a nice clean surface, and yes, I'm gonna bother a bit with it. Oh, this is Brenda's first time watching from Oklahoma. Hi, Brenda. Oh, hi, Brenda, and welcome. What do you think so far? You need to introduce yourself, me. I've got a new watcher. Okay, my name is Mihai. <laughs> <laughs> we are from Woodbend, UK. And we gladly welcome you to our family of creators. Yeah, please let us know what you think about it. And uh, I'm Leah, I'm behind the camera, which is probably why the camera's always shaking. <laughs> And uh, when you see my hand pop into the camera, it's because I'm actually doing some TikTok videos, which you can watch, um, obviously, by following our TikToks, if you've got TikTok. And, oh yeah, so Brenda's asking, where can you get the Woodrow Bend mouldings from? So I'll send you a link to find a stockist in your area, Brenda. But if you're in the US, we've got stockists all over the US, so don't panic. <laughs> you ain't gonna remain without them. And if you absolutely love the pieces and projects that you see us creating on our live videos, um, you can actually purchase them on our Etsy store, which I'll also put a link to. And while you watch it, why don't you like, comment and share and be in with a chance of winning the wonderful stencil that we just shown. Solange says, Mihai's going on vacations. He's very relaxed today. He is. He's less of a music box today. <laughs> well, I'm relaxed maybe because it's Friday. So, you know that that mood of weekend. Okay, so. That being done. We got to go for the paint. And I'm going to start with the moulding. And the pointed teeth being brushed. Helps a lot. As you can see, cover is magnificent. And the pointed brush, you don't have to pass almost many times over as it covers the whole, the whole area, all the details. Very, very well, because thanks to its pointed tip, it goes into all the intricate details. What does everybody think of this colour? I think it's beautiful. <laughs> Solange says, usually Mihai looks like a speedy Gonzalez when he activates that mode to finish a piece. And he still does it perfectly. <laughs> right, let's take out your brush. 
So the pain me high. Honestly, season. maybe it's because it's quite <laughs> hot today. Yeah, he's all lost the energy. <laughs> he needs another coffee. Everybody sprinkle some love to get me high coffee. The <laughs> that's why. I was feeling that something is missing. It's coffee. Silly me. Could you tell everybody what paint you're using? We're using a uh, La Magic Flor de Sal color paint. It's an Italian manufacturer, so. And it smells quite, quite nice as well. It's not a usual paint smell. Okay. <laughs> Everybody's sending you some coffee emojis. Do you feel more energized now? Yes, I do. <laughs> He's off. Send me coffee, ladies and gentlemen. Right. Okay, we've got five minutes. Yeah. You say five minutes and he's like... <laughs> you know what? I'm going to put the arm under. And for everybody who is watching right now, we do have some very, very, very exciting news. So on Monday, our new Woody Bend uh, designs are being released. So if you tune into our Monday Live, you'll be able to see the new releases firsthand. And um, yeah, probably before they go live even on the website, which is very exciting. Okay. And remember, whilst you've still got five minutes left of today's live, there's still a chance to win the stencil that we're giving away today. So it's the Moroccan Melody stencil. It's absolutely gorgeous. And the best thing about our stencils is that they're reusable. So you literally just rinse them off, hang them up to dry, and you can use them again for any project. So all you have to do to win is like, share, and comment. And we'll announce the winner on Monday in the creators group. Which will be recommended to join if you haven't joined it yet. So we share quite a lot of exclusive details in there. Okay, so that's the best layer. I'll give a quick try. Come on. Sí. Cubre increíble con esta pintura. Es pintura de la Mache, que es una marca italiana. Es fantástica, sí. Now I'm going to go for the top while the, the side is drying. See that we have five minutes. Uh, where is it? Here. <laughs> Nicole says he's quite an aggressive painter. I can imagine he is extremely speedy with coffee. <laughs> no. You will never see such a fast person when me has a coffee. Wait, 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 uh, of course I can. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. <laughs> right. So we set up for, for the top to use my magic paint. Sweet milk. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Which we're not going to cover it 100% as we want to maintain some wooden texture under. But we want to give that pale white color. Oh, that smells amazing, that one. Mm hmm. Wish you guys had smell of vision. <laughs> Yeah, so Solange, this pit doesn't need a primer. Okay. Is that kind of why for a lot of our projects we don't really have to prime them unless it's a slippery surface? Who's sending too much coffee? <laughs> Oh, muchas gracias, Nekta. Bienvenidos a esta página. Si es mucho bien, mi amor, y tenemos aquí mi hi. Hola. Oh, my students shared this with all of their friends. 
So Nicole, this isn't a posh shop pin. No, this is a magic pin. They're one of our brand friends and they're an incredible company. They're so friendly. Um, and it applies amazingly to Woody Pen. If you're interested in the posh shop products, I'll put a link and you can have a browse of them as well. Oh, this is great. You can kind of see it on the camera. It's keeping the right. original texture of the right. wood. So, give me a second. Okay. Now I'm just going to catch it. Okay, uh, how are we the time? We are on, have a look here, 42, we've got three minutes to make it look beautiful, Mihai. Sorry? <laughs> three minutes. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. Oh, Sylvia says, genial como siempre, it's always, always great. Um, yeah, Nicole, so on the topic, is it a wash or is it a paint? How would you describe what you do? It's a paint. Oh, it's, it's a paint. paint. It's a... Uh... La Magic Paint Sweet Milk. And that's its actual name. I'm not inventing it. Oh, it's Lorena's first time watching us on Woody Bank. Can everybody send a big hello to Lorena? Hi, Lorena. Okay. Just imagine how beautiful these drawers are going to look. Wow. We'll post a finished picture of uh, what Mihai does today on our Artisans group, which is where the winner from the giveaway will also be announced. Oh, guys, we're on 151 viewers. If you give it a couple more shares, then we'll be able to pick another 49. winner. 49 more. 49 more viewers. So like, share, and comment this video, and you'll be in with a chance of winning one, not only the Moroccan Melody stencil, but also a bag of Would You Bend goodies. Which I'll show here. So you've probably seen a lot of projects using this as well. They're fantastic. They're just a little, almost a sample bag really of broken mouldings that you can apply to any project. And just to get a feel of what you bend, which is great. And we're also going to start selling these. So this might be one of your last chances to get a free bag. Yeah, you might use that bag as a Lego. So it's great your own moulding. So if you won the Moroccan Melody stencil, where would you put it and on what project? Do you have a project that you're doing or something that you've got in mind? I think it's a beautiful piece, it's really got like a mandala effect, wonderful circle. So to win it's just a case of share, share, share and comment that you've shared it and we'll pick a winner on Monday on our group. Oh, Elizabeth is new here from Los Angeles, California. Hi. Hi, Elizabeth. We've got so many new people. It's lovely to see you all. Valerie, Valerie shared and liked. Michelle shared it, she says I love it, it's beautiful, honestly one of my favourite projects. Oh, stop you. <laughs> I mean I haven't really been here that long to have others, but I wish I could have seen the chest of dress. Chest of jest. That's a beautiful one, that one. You haven't seen it? I've seen it, oh, okay. but I never saw it being me. I didn't oh, see the okay. talent in action. I didn't see Sweetie Gonzalez with his paintbrush going. <laughs> wow, you sent me coffee. I had it. Right, what do you think? Should we give them the final view with the doors? Oh, go on then. You see, Diana, los pozos de molduras eh, en el futuro eh, vendemos eh, la postura, pero en este momento son parte de un giveaway. Y para, uh, 
¿Cómo se dice en español? Para ganar el giveaway tiene que hacer una me gusta, eh, dejar un comento y um, contribuir. <risa> Maybe that's Italian. Eh, el vídeo. Y eh, sí. ¿Estás Yes, go, go, go. Okay. So, that's it. I you don't speak Spanish. <laughs> Number so yeah, we'll be posting the finished pictures of this in our artisans and creators group, which I'll put a link to in the comments. So you'll be able to see this as exclusive content before it goes live on our Facebook, on the main Facebook page. And that's number. Come on. Well, yeah, I need to add some. WD40. Here it is. Oh wow, look at that. You know what, I'll tell you that. That's wow. absolutely stunning. Beautiful. And I'll turn it so you can see. Yes, here it is. Here it is. The masterpiece. Oh, everybody's sending so many sprinkles. Thank Ooh. you, everybody. Done. He's done it. I'm gonna take a break <laughs> He's now. He's done. <laughs> right? Uh, so, that's it for now. The other side, we're gonna finish, finish it with the cameras off. And once it's done, we're gonna post in our post second with the artisan group. Awesome. Oh, you guys are getting a couple more minutes of uh, good stuff. Remember, keep sharing this video to be able to chance of winning the giveaway whilst we've got a couple more minutes left. So we're going in all the time. We've got Solly here as well. Hi. Everyone say hi. So yeah, I think we should do a little bit of dry brushing on these. Oh, Nicole, why don't we go over it again? Come on, you have to get a good coverage. Well, I was going to put a second layer. <laughs> Diana says you need to come to Mexico and high and do a demonstration on at least 20 pieces of furniture. Wow, that's not happening. <laughs> and he'll do it in 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're gonna get me a lot of coffee. <laughs> Where's your water? Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's right. So, can you guys say what you're doing now on the Woodry Bend for everybody who's watching? Uh, Nick and I is going to take my brush over the Woodry Bend mouldings. Ooh, and I've painted the floor. That's okay, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to take a That was definitely a purposeful mistake, but you were actually painting the entire floor but in the magic. <laughs> there you go. Oh, everyone's saying it's absolutely gorgeous. It is, it is. Okay, now I'm going to try, uh, try it. Yeah, Diana's saying, um, <laughs> We all need to go and we need to decorate lots of furniture all together. And then we're probably going to black wax this, guys. Because there's too many imperfections on it to keep it nice and clean. Um, so the best, the best thing for us to do is to brown wax it. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna apply fast chalk white and metallic smooth metallic paste. 
uh, gentle dry brushing or heavy load? Heavy load. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get excited. And remember, everyone, there's still time to share for the well. giveaway. Whilst me, Hi, is lathering on some wonderful posh chalk, smooth metallic paste. Really bringing out like all the details in it. Huh? It's bringing out all the details. It's gonna be lovely with some wax on. I thought heavy too. Yes, <laughs> a lunch. <laughs> Hi, Nicole. What are you doing this weekend? Working. <laughs> <laughs> Just want to. I want to uh, give a shout out to the Sparkle Six in the USA. They've been absolutely fabulous. Kathy, Chris, Beth, Justin. And the other two members, can't remember the name now. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um, they've been so supportive. They're using Would You Bone. They're all ambassadors, and uh, the work they're doing is absolutely fabulous. So here's a shout out to the Sparkle Six guys. If any of the Sparkle Six are still watching, yeah, Bess with us. Pop your link in, Beth, Beth, so um, people can pop on over to your page and have a look at the fabulous work you're doing. <laughs> I almost saw that my lips are seven. Right, I'm just going to come in over there to yeah. get a little bit more of the white. Yeah. Oh, Wendy, I love the moulding too. It's so delicate. I think because the drawers have got so much detail in, it's great just to have a little bit of drama on the sides, but not too much. And this moulding just is perfect. Yeah. It won't be too much. I'm not going to blather the whole thing in brown wax. It's just. It's not neat enough to keep it a clean piece, unfortunately. Um, it was a very old, the, the substrate was very old and quite knackered. And we did get some cracking in the paint uh, on the front. We didn't really want it, but it happened. So the best way to disguise that is to use some brown or black. Well, yeah, I'll use brown wax paint. And there you have it. I think that's it. The sink. Always remember, guys, to have you done the white wax yet? Yeah, oh, you have. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Beautiful. I'm just going to take them off here. Without... Oh, there you go. Try and hold oh, that yeah, cable yeah. there. There you go, guys. You want to swing it round, okay? Mikai's done an awesome job with that. With that trim there. Swing the whole thing around so people can see it. Oh, fabulous. Voila. Fabulous. Wow, I'd take that home. I would take that home in an instant. And if anybody else wants to take it home, it might end up on our Etsy stock. So stay tuned. And that's all we've got time for today, guys. And um, it's a good bag from me. And me. <laughs> oh, and moi. <laughs> Have a nice weekend, everyone. Have a lovely day. Bye. See you soon, guys. Bye, everybody. Bye. Right, so Mikai, do we...